when you get to the highest levels, because you I mean you're fighting, you're fighting pretty much at Demetrius Johnson and, and Conor McGregor. You know, I mean, you're fighting a, a true mixed martial arts with a big mouth. And I said the biggest thing for for him, and I gave them the analogy how I woke up that day and I saw my team was nervous. And I said, guys, the weight, you know, the, the weight of the victory to this fight with Demetrius is is the fact that I got to have composure. And, uh, and I told the same thing to to Khabib because. It's gonna be a composure thing. You cannot get emotional. You cannot. You cannot get overwhelmed because guys like that will will bite down and and and, 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 and kill you. And do you know what time is it? What time is it? A bit time. Where is my bed? Head into the weigh-ins. This is the moment of truth. You know, the face-off. Get to stare into the soul. I'm not part of team. Read them. This is the fight right here. This is where the fight's won. Uh, we're gonna now come to the official weight to UFC. I've been feeling good, good shape. Everything is good. But we have to come to the cage. I will kill this guy. Now I can see you guys. Now I can see you. Drink, eat, sleep. Now I can see you guys. The ego is full. What do you wanna, what do you wanna, what do you wanna talk about? How are you feeling, man? Feeling great. Alhamdulillah, everything is good. It's a team. It's a team. This is why they're always together, man. I, I've learned in Russia that these, these, these guys stick together, bro. And you know, there's a reason why Khabib's oh, like 50, 30 dudes all the time. These dudes are, these dudes are brothers, man. And it's cool. You can feel, you can feel the love. Сейчас мы собираемся на взвешивание официально. Хабиба поддержат целая команда здесь все. Иншаллах будет победа, победа за нами завтра. Иншаллах. Most important tomorrow night. Иншаллах. Now he kill everything, bro. I've heard, I'm old, man. I'm four years old. I don't want to fight nobody. As long as they don't touch me, they're good. I need medium. Medium. Good to see you. Good to see you, bro. How are you? Good. I was in Russia for a week. Glad I give. That's the man, dude. That's the man right here. Ali, baby. The most loyal guy in MMA. Thank you, champ. Right here. You guys better put that on Embedded, too. He's dominant in MMA, but. Demetrius Johnson, my friend. Very close. Hi, your friend. Because we play, we play too much video game, you know. Because yeah. <laughs> game. Because a game or something. Because I don't play games. You play real games, bro. For what? Yeah, it's like, it's like, it's like, it looks like little kid beans, look. Huh? Yeah, Ali. Diamonds, look, look, Ali. Why are you talking about shit, Ali? Who's this?
I think stylistically, it's a nightmare matchup. I think it's a nightmare matchup for both, both of, them. of them. I think anyone who goes, oh, Connor, you know, he can't wrestle, he can't do this, he's just going to get taken down and pounded out. You're so off, it's not even funny. You yeah. don't know the game, man. He absolutely is capable of stuffing a takedown or two in the early going. That's what's up. Because in the early going, he's got that stinger of a left hand. His, and foot, he, his movement. His, his footwork. His movement, his footwork, and Khabib is going to know that coming in. He's going to be a little hesitant. He's not going to walk towards him like Edson Barboza did. Or he did in the Edson Barboza fight. He can't. Because Barboza is mostly kicks. Barboza throws tie a style. lot of kicks, a lot of tie style kicks. And Khabib just put a tremendous amount of pressure on him and then got a hold of him. But Connor's going to crack him with hands, and his footwork is way better. Yes. He's, he's, he's just way better at moving in and moving out. I, I think when people go, oh, it's either Connor starches him and gets the KO, or Khabib just takes him down for five rounds and pounds him out. I think uh, I think it's a it's a classic fight. I think it's back and forth. I think it's a fucking dog fight. Yeah. I think it's a fight of our lives, man. I, I really do. I think you're probably right. I think, I, think I think you're getting a fucking great fight from two guys where there's more on the line than just win or lose we we've also never seen khabib fight with high stakes right like when he fought al Quinta, that was in high stakes al's an amazing fighter but that's not the same as fighting conor mcgregor right when he's fighting uh edson barboza that's not high stakes when you're fighting conor mcgregor conor takes all the chips on that poker table puts it all in the middle goes i'm all in you have to be all in i do well under these circumstances how do you respond yeah so for we've never seen khabib and everyone goes oh his cardio is great it is great but when the fucking uh, that Irish nation is this motherfucker's coming to fight, and he might get taken down, yes, I guarantee he gets taken down. That motherfucker's gonna get back up. He's gonna get up. He's gonna keep getting up, and Khabib's gonna keep coming. And we got a dog fight, man. I think both guys are gonna be fucked up after this fight. And to me, a fight is not a fight until there's resistance, until there's something to overcome. Something to overcome. Otherwise, it's just an athletic venture. It's an exhibition. I think life is that. I think that you don't know if a lawyer is a lawyer until, until there's something to overcome in the courtroom. Something goes wrong, okay? I, I, I know he's a lawyer. I know he went to school. I get it. Nobody has to tell me that. But he ain't a lawyer. The thing is, when Mac fight this magnitude, you better make sure there's security around at all times because this is more than just business. This is personal. You are not in a fight. I, I, look, I, I admit it. I equate life to a fight. I do. You're not in a fight until there's pressure, resistance, overcoming something. Otherwise, it's just an exhibition. Tyson's talent was so great. His physical ability, his talent was so overwhelming. Just like somebody's intellect. Just somebody's charisma. Whatever. Beauty until it came to something else. But his talent was so superior that the other stuff never got tested. He was blowing guys out, and he it never got tested if there was anything in the warehouse, so to speak. Thank you, brother. Thank you so much, brother. The most important fight, inshallah. Stay calm, stay relaxed. Everything is good. Tomorrow night, we're gonna see this, brother. Nothing, nothing gonna happen, inshallah. Let's go. Trust. 